What's going on, y'all? It's Corner Sports Net. Do not forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. You know, Jackson State, they updated their roster online. They got nine SEC players on the roster. Mostly transfers. You got Deion's son, Shiloh Sanders from South Carolina. You got Niles Gaddy from Tennessee. You got Aubrey Miller. He's from Missouri. You got Malachi Wadman. He's from Tennessee. You got Josh Lanier from Alabama. You got stud lineman Dylan Spencer. He's from Missouri. You got Randall Haney, the grad transfer from Vanderbilt. Now all these guys should be able to help Jackson State, especially for the opener. You know, for the opener, because Florida a and we need them to contribute. We need them to ball out. Some will, some won't. Now there's one SEC player that's no longer on the roster. And that's Javaris Selman. I don't know what happened. It's a transfer from Mississippi State. I don't know if he had trouble with the grades. I don't know if he's just in cut. I don't know what happened. I need y'all to let me know what happened to Javoris Selman. He was Dion's first SEC transfer back in 2020. So uh, I don't know what happened. Maybe transferred again. I need y'all to let me know what happened to Javara Selman. And wherever he's at, I wish him nothing but good health and success. I wish no ill will towards anybody. No student athletes. Really nobody. Hope he's doing okay. Jackson State is well stocked with SEC transfers, SEC players. That's why I can't wait till the first game of the season. Most of the transfers couldn't play during the spring, so they hungry, they ready. They looking to get back on that field. So let's, think, let's see how they do September 5th against Florida a and I just can't wait. When they got, what, two weeks away? So if y'all know me, y'all know I'm always walking. So I got a little bit of time on my hands today. So I'm just gonna finish up my walk. I'll talk to you guys later. Corner Sports Network.